came out of, where did we go? Um, Deadwood this morning. First day and I've already forgot where I'm at. <laughs> we ate, it, ended up eating in uh, Chevron? Chadron. Chadron, yeah. Uh, so, and it was graduation day for the, the college up there, so that was pretty cool when we came to town. Uh, but when we came into Nebraska, it was just fabulous. It's been a pretty safe ride in so far. Yeah. Uh, talk about coming here and seeing all the people here waiting for you. Crazy. The excitement through town. And Crazy. The American Legion that they escorted us in, you know, uh, which was super cool. But then when you roll over the interstate right now, you, know, you just roll over the top of the interstate, you see the Holiday Inn Express sitting here. And the parking lot was packed, man. It was like, oh my gosh, what are these people doing out on a, on a Saturday night? You know, come to see us. You told me when I talked to you on the phone, but reiterate again just the, the impact of this charity ride and the meaning behind everything. For you. Yeah, you know, it's, it's it, obviously for me it's special because of that. We, we built camp in the memory of my son Adam, uh, who was killed in. in 2020 in a racing accident. Camp's been open 20 years. We've seen 125,000 kids need to come through the gates. Um, every one of these riders, every one of these bikes you see come in with the people, uh, they believe in that cause. So it, it's just so important, it's so cool. So it's, it's just been a fun day. We've had so many people who've been doing this for a while. I've just called it yeah. for the last 20 years. Yeah, that's crazy. And a bunch of other names that have just been around um, just to have them do this journey with you. Yeah, that's, that mean? that's the funny part. It, it, it shows that I'm not as big a horse as we're in as people think I am. I hadn't, I hadn't run them off in 20 years. So there you go. Yep. That's what it shows more than anything. But it shows how kind they are. That's what it really shows, how kind they are. Hey, man, I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you, man. It's great to be I appreciate it. Nice seeing you. So I'm trying to think. I have five bikes out here. So I'm trying to figure out, and one of them is during Christ, one of them, uh, family, which one are you talking about? Uh, the ones, the one with, with you on it, with like, uh, just different, oh, oh, you different know, pictures I, of you. I, I painted that just to paint bikes. I do a lot of different things with bikes and, and that's a, a sort of paint a bike of my life, all the things I've done in my life and stuff. So that's, that's, that's probably what that is. Did that one, did all my family and, uh, who else is up there? President Trump is there. Uh, my company is there, my family is with me, some of my family is here with me, so they came in, so I got some of them riding, so we've been doing this for about 18 years now, so it's been a lot of fun. Yeah. Big biker family? Uh, well, you know what's so funny is I collect cars and motorcycles, but I thought when people was going to tra travel across the country, it was crazy, but once... I found out what it was for, um, you know, for Victory Junction, for Clunky or Kids. I decided to do it with them 18 years ago and I hadn't quit. Can you just tell us about the uh, the Jesus bike? Uh, the Jesus bike, I was born, born up in the church. Uh, it's funny, I, uh, I'm a big Christian, I love the Lord Jesus. And, you know, when everyone thinks of a bike, they think of the skull, the crossbow, and all that stuff. And that's not me. Uh, I said, my mom probably wouldn't let me in the house if I brought home a bike looking like that. So uh, when they were going to paint the bike, he said, what do you want on it? And I said, let's do the last supper. Let's do all this. And they thought I was crazy. And Rick got it together. Rick from uh, Stokers in, in, in Texas did that bike, and it's absolutely beautiful. I think that's probably one of the best one I have. Uh, just from when you look at what the bike, oh, yeah. when you look at it, that is an incredible, incredible bike. A lot of, a lot of work in it. That's where I grew up.